Hello everyone! Have you ever accidentally left your solo world on public? If so, what would you do if someone joined your private server? Do you kick the player or do you just leave them be and let them do whatever? It's an interesting question because I find that whenever I join a random person's world I get banned immediately. So today I wanted to find out if you were to join any random server, what is the probability that you would get kicked? What percentage of people forget to set their world to private when making it? So I sat down one morning and joined through 20 worlds. I didn't actually do anything to the worlds themselves, but I did pick Willow to scare people. And that strategy goes about as well as expected. Alright, immediately go Willow. <laughs> Sometimes I got kicked for seemingly no reason. Blueprint. Bird trap. I have a bird trap blueprint. <laughs> no! <laughs> but I did find that more often than not, people actually didn't mind random players joining their worlds. In fact, I definitely wasn't expecting to find people who were actually really kind to a total stranger. Did you give me food? Thanks. 9 out of 20 times I got kicked immediately after joining, which makes sense, especially when their world has the map revealed, while a willow starts charging towards your base. No, that's fair enough. I mean, the whole map was exposed when I joined. Another 9 out of 20 people let me stay on their world, so I just dropped my stuff and then left after a day, since my work there had been done. In a few other instances, I came across a guy who was AFKing for drops, and another guy who was spawn camping his own server. What? What does this mean? Is this guy trying to spawn camp people? No. I'll, I'll put a skeleton down here for him. There you go, you have a nice decorational skeleton now. Or maybe he just thought that he made a really good spawn base. I don't know, he was also AFK. Regardless, I actually enjoyed this experience a lot more than I thought I would. It was a lot of fun checking out random people's worlds and seeing what they're up to in there. I recommend you try it out for yourself sometime and see what antics people are up to there. Anyways, you may be thinking, well duh, of course you got kicked half the time. You literally joined a random server, didn't say hello and then immediately picked Willow. Obviously people are going to kick you when you look like a griefer. And I agree. So I tried this again the next day, but this time I acted friendly and chose Wormwood. Because nobody would kick the character who gives you free living logs. And that is exactly how I got my kick percent world record. Oh, <laughs> I couldn't even get- I couldn't even pick Wormwood before he got kicked. That has to be the fastest anyone's been kicked from a server. I dare all you professional speedrunners to beat that. So yeah, it turns out it doesn't really matter what you do. If someone wants to kick you, they will kick you. I still had a lot of fun going through the servers, especially this world, where this guy has possibly the best speedrun seed in existence. That night head and the night marble are on the same screen at spawn. How lucky do you have to be to find something like that? This guy probably doesn't even know how absurd this world gen is. He's going to continue living his life without ever realizing what kind of insane world he got out. Uh, oh, never mind. I just got it as well. Cool. So in total, the chances of you getting kicked and not getting kicked is basically 50-50, which makes sense. I specifically targeted servers with one person in them and with the default world name, which probably means they want to be left alone. Even still, it seems like half these servers were actually expecting people to join them, seeing as the game is called Don't Starve Together. Anyways, time to show you all the random server shenanigans I came across during this. This entire spawn hasn't been picked at all, which means this guy just spawned in left without taking anything, and then somehow got a backpack. He also has a weird bridge in this world. Um, <laughs> wait, there's like a whole little mini island base thing he has here. Wait, what if we build something on this random guy's server? Look at this place. Right next to spawn bridge, you can build something here. There's so much potential for a mega base. I hope this guy keeps this world. Oh, hi. He is Chester. Your world is cool. 
Yes, I'm glad he agrees. Oh hell yeah, he's, we're chopping trees. Okay, he just made a garland. Um, I wanted to make a dumb base there, but now I'm worried that if I do that, he's gonna actually base that spawn. <laughs> I don't wanna, I don't wanna do that to him. Wait, did he make a backpack? F oh, he made a backpack for me. I didn't expect him to do that. I have five golden rocks. Well, this guy is actually cool. I didn't expect that we would find people like this today. And now we write a sign. Uh, this will probably get griefed, but you know. Welcome to spawn base. Come to spawn. I have a surprise. Oh, he, <laughs> he found it. <laughs> Goodbye now. Super. <laughs> Damn, that was a good server. <laughs> I did not expect that to happen. Spring? Who would start in spring? Okay, this guy must be some seasoned professional if he wants to start the game in spring. Damn it, where did he die? We have to help this man. Meet me at spawn. Oh, he's here. Lead me to your skeleton. Let's go, Wilson. You went really far. Damn. Where the hell did you die? Aha, we're getting close, I think. There's spiders here. Okay. Resurrection. Yes, we did it. He's back. Alright. There you go. Have fun. You know what? Even though we didn't really do much that server, at least we didn't get kicked. 995. This is a good world to get the ban speedrun world record. Oh, he's rebuilding the portal. Ooh, I know where the base is. I don't think there's anything I can give this guy that he doesn't already have. It's day 995. That's basically day 1000. What the hell is this? Whoa, this guy... This guy's like a spawn base, I think, for people who join. Is that a basement? This guy has a basement. What the... What? What? How much grass is in here? What? He just puts this stuff in a basement next to spawn? This is a really cool world. He hasn't even kicked me. Like, for all he knows, I could be burning his base right now. I'm not, but I could be. Wait, let's, let's go find the main part of his base. He's the little moon tin there, which probably means that's where his base is. Is it summer? Oh, it's summer. Wait, is this picking next to Dragonfly? It is. That's... that's a good world. Now I understand why this guy went for a thousand days here. What? Why are they fighting each other? What? I have never seen this happen. Wait, smallish tall bird? They're all smallish tall... what? What? Wait, maybe he could use the meat. I don't want to go near them though. Hey guys, can I have your meat? Wait, they seem friendly, what the hell? Okay. Oh, we found the base. Oh, this is cool. Here's a, a Mac Tusk farm. He built his base at the Mac Tusk, it looks like. Oh, hi. Whoa, here's a bunch of meat in here. Let's drop my stuff in there. This is a cool world. <laughs> What did I do? <laughs> what the? I found a nothing world. Yeah, wait, this is actually a nothing world. AFK nothing world, let's go. Let's go, Willow. Wait, actually, Willow was like an S tier character here. Oh. There's a bit of shenanigans going on. A little bit of spawned in stuff, we could say. Minimalist challenge. We have confirmation this guy watches me. But where is he? I think he's AFK. He's most likely AFK. <gasps> there they are. Time to wake th wake up. Wake up. From your AFK. Oh, hi. What is he doing here? It's day 112. Do you AFK for skins here? Yeah. Okay. Some players came and I helped them with the food problem. Ah. I'm gonna leave my mark on this world. Thank you. 78 walls. Alright, now that I've left my mark on this world, <laughs> under all of this, right, subscribe. <laughs>
Alright, I have completed it. I have completed the subscribe because he told me to. That that is not me, definitely. <laughs> I have left my mark on this world. Goodbye. Quick question. Oh, who are you?